We're going to progress a little bit along. This would be our warm up. We go to the next one. And the next one we call up, back, and through. So now the attack is more centrally. This attack was from the flank. Now we are attacking more centrally. We have the same organization. We have a flank player. We have another flank player. We have our target player. And we have our support player. So it's basically a diamond shape in the warm up, as you see it. Okay. Basically, the two guys can be support players here. Just step out for a second, just for the picture. Just step out. So we only have one target player. Okay, just step out. All right. The idea here is that whenever we have a ball played forward, and that ball is played now back, that we still need forward runs to get behind the line of the defense. So the exercise is a support player will knock the ball to our target player, who is marked basically by two guys. Get behind him. Get behind him. Come up to the line. Mark, come up a little higher. Good. All the way tight. All the way tight. There you go. Good. So you basically you don't do anything. You let him have his ball. But he knows he cannot turn right now. It's one against two. Okay, so he has very little uh, chance of success. He also recognizes there will be a support player coming in right away. He receives the ball, he knocks it back, and then we need to see forward runs. And those forward runs ideally come from the guys on the flank who either come in diagonally by attacking the gap here or straight by running behind the outside back. Okay? When would I come in diagonally? Alex, step to the line. It's all a matter of recognizing situations offensively. In this situation, if I would run straight, Alex would have the advantage because he is closer to the goal by a, about five yards. He simply turns, he will run down the ball, and we have no chance of attacking further. So you see this huge gap right here between the left back and the left, uh, the left center back, and that would be a moment where we make the run diagonally in. Okay? Vice versa, Alex come inside. You're closing this gap, good. So now he recognizes this. This is the situation. Offensively, wouldn't make a whole lot of sense to run diagonally inside. So now he's trying to get in the blind side of our left back by making the straight run. You guys good on that? Okay, outside backs. You can vary your position on the next one you can come inside a little bit more. On the next one, you can go to the line a little bit more. Same over here, Alex. Just switch it up. One time you go to the line, one time you go in the middle, and we take it from there. Ready? And go. Up, back, and through. And we were offside. Okay? We were offside. Ball back, so timing. We have to be patient. Okay, we cannot run prematurely. You have to always recognize the line. Ready, play. Up, back, and through. Good. And finish the attack. Okay.